Welcome to our YouTube audiobook summary of To Kill a Mockingbird by Harper Lee, a literary masterpiece that has captured the hearts and minds of readers around the world. Join us as we delve into the profound themes and poignant storytelling that have made this novel a timeless classic. Harper Lee, born on April 28, 1926, in Monroeville, Alabama, drew inspiration from her own experiences growing up in the racially divided American South during the 1930s. Lee's deeply empathetic and perceptive observations of the injustices and prejudices of that era laid the foundation for To Kill a Mockingbird. The novel, published in 1960, not only resonated with readers of its time but has continued to be celebrated as a literary tour de force. To Kill a Mockingbird is a powerful exploration of race, morality, and the loss of innocence in a small southern town called Maycomb, Alabama, during the Great Depression. Through the eyes of its young protagonist, Scout Finch, the story unfolds with a keen sense of authenticity and a remarkable depth of insight. As we embark on this summary, we are introduced to Scout, a spirited and inquisitive girl who, alongside her brother Jem and friend Dill, navigates the complexities of a society steeped in racial prejudice. Their father, Atticus Finch, emerges as a beacon of integrity and compassion as he defends Tom Robinson, a black man falsely accused of a crime, in a racially charged trial. Harper Lee's eloquent prose and vivid descriptions transport us to the fictional town of Maycomb, immersing us in its rich tapestry of characters and the deeply ingrained social divisions of the time. Through her masterful storytelling, Lee exposes the harsh realities of racism and challenges readers to confront their own biases, making To Kill a Mockingbird a powerful catalyst for social introspection and change. This seminal work examines themes of racial inequality, social injustice, and the destructive power of stereotypes. By presenting these issues through the innocent yet perceptive lens of a child, Lee forces us to confront the inherent unfairness and moral contradictions that persist in society. To Kill a Mockingbird also explores the loss of innocence and the coming-of-age journey as Scout grapples with the complexities of the world around her. As she encounters the enigmatic Boo Radley, confronts the prejudices of her community, and witnesses the trial that shakes Maycomb to its core, Scout's perspective on life and human nature is forever altered. Harper Lee's exceptional storytelling prowess, combined with her ability to create relatable and memorable characters, has earned her numerous accolades and the adoration of readers worldwide. To Kill a Mockingbird stands as a testament to the power of literature to provoke thought, challenge societal norms, and inspire empathy and understanding. In this audiobook summary, we invite you to delve into the profound themes and timeless wisdom of To Kill a Mockingbird. Join us as we celebrate Harper Lee's unparalleled contribution to the literary landscape and explore the enduring relevance of this remarkable novel. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to stay updated on our latest audiobook summaries. Join us in celebrating the power of literature and the transformative journey of To Kill a Mockingbird by Harper Lee. To Kill a Mockingbird by Harper Lee is a literary masterpiece that explores profound themes of racial injustice, morality, and the loss of innocence in the racially divided American South during the 1930s. Set in the fictional town of Maycomb, Alabama, the novel follows the life of Scout Finch, a young girl growing up amidst the turmoil of the Great Depression. Through Scout's innocent and curious perspective, readers are introduced to the complex social dynamics of Maycomb. She navigates her world alongside her older brother Jem, their imaginative friend Dill, and their experiences shape their understanding of the deeply ingrained prejudices that exist within their community. Scout's father, Atticus Finch, emerges as a moral compass and a beacon of integrity. As a lawyer, Atticus represents an essential figure who stands against the prevailing racism and discrimination of the time. He becomes involved in a highly controversial case defending Tom Robinson, a black man falsely accused of raping a white woman. As the trial unfolds, Harper Lee presents a searing critique of the racial inequality and injustice that permeates Maycomb society. 
Atticus's unwavering commitment to truth and justice clashes with the deep-rooted prejudices of the townspeople, resulting in tension and conflict. Lee's vivid descriptions and meticulous characterizations bring Maycomb to life, painting a picture of a town sharply divided along racial lines. The stark contrast between the white and black communities becomes apparent as Scout encounters individuals like Calpurnia, the Finch family's black housekeeper, and the mysterious Boo Radley, who becomes an object of fascination and fear. As Scout's understanding of the world expands, she begins to grapple with the complex nature of morality and the inherent unfairness of the society she inhabits. Through her observations, readers are exposed to the harsh realities of racism, prejudice, and the destructive power of societal norms. To Kill a Mockingbird stands as a powerful indictment of the deep-rooted racism and social injustice prevalent in the American South. Harper Lee's masterful storytelling and richly drawn characters provide a compelling exploration of the human condition, challenging readers to confront their own biases and question the prevailing norms of their own time and place. The novel's impact extends far beyond its pages, as it continues to inspire generations with its timeless message of empathy, compassion, and the pursuit of justice in an imperfect world. In the second part of To Kill a Mockingbird, Harper Lee delves deeper into the intricate web of social divisions, prejudice, and the quest for justice in the town of Maycomb. As the trial of Tom Robinson, a black man falsely accused of rape, continues to unfold, the racial tensions reach a boiling point. Scout and Jem, Atticus Finch's children, bear witness to the deeply ingrained racism and the immense challenges faced by their father as he defends Tom in the courtroom. The trial serves as a catalyst, highlighting the stark contrast between Atticus's unwavering commitment to truth and justice and the prevailing prejudices of Maycomb's white community. Throughout the trial, Lee skillfully reveals the flaws in the justice system and the inherent biases that pervade society. Despite overwhelming evidence in favor of Tom's innocence, the all-white jury delivers a guilty verdict, reflecting the deep-rooted racism that continues to shape the town. As Scout, Jem, and their friend Dill process the trial's outcome, they are confronted with the harsh realities of injustice and the realization that their world is far from fair. The children begin to grasp the weight of prejudice and the immense challenges faced by those who strive to combat it. Lee also introduces the character of Mrs. Henry Lafayette DuBose, a cantankerous old woman who becomes a lesson in courage and resilience for the children. Atticus encourages his children to look beyond the surface, to understand the complexities of people's lives, and to have empathy even for those they find difficult to like. Through Scout's growth and evolving understanding, readers are invited to reflect on their own biases and prejudices. The novel challenges the notion of innocence as Scout grapples with the complexities of the adult world and comes face to face with the harsh realities of racism and inequality. Harper Lee's evocative storytelling continues to captivate readers, exploring profound themes such as empathy, compassion, and the moral responsibility to confront injustice. To Kill a Mockingbird serves as a powerful reminder of the enduring impact of discrimination and the courage required to stand against it. As we move forward in the summary, we will uncover the final part of the novel, delving into the lasting impact of To Kill a Mockingbird and its resonant messages of compassion, understanding, and the pursuit of truth and justice in a divided society. In the concluding part of To Kill a Mockingbird, Harper Lee further delves into the lasting impact of the novel's themes and characters, as well as the transformative journey of its young protagonist, Scout Finch. As Scout continues to navigate the complexities of Maycomb, she encounters the enigmatic Boo Radley, a recluse who becomes a source of fascination and curiosity for the children. Through Scout's interactions with Boo, she learns valuable lessons about empathy, understanding, and the potential for growth and change. The novel reaches its climax when Scout and Jem find themselves in a life-threatening situation. In a violent altercation, they are rescued by an unexpected guardian angel, revealing the true nature of Boo Radley and challenging the prejudices and stereotypes that had previously defined him. Through this pivotal moment, 
Harper Lee underscores the transformative power of compassion and challenges the deeply ingrained prejudices that divide society. The events that unfold serve as a catalyst for Scout's maturation, as she gains a deeper understanding of human nature and the complexities of the world around her. To Kill a Mockingbird concludes with Scout's reflection on the events that shaped her childhood, emphasizing the loss of innocence that comes with the harsh realities of prejudice and injustice. Scout acknowledges the importance of embracing empathy and understanding as she navigates the complexities of the adult world. Harper Lee's poignant exploration of racial inequality, moral responsibility, and the loss of innocence resonates with readers long after they finish the novel. To Kill a Mockingbird stands as a testament to the enduring power of literature to provoke thought, challenge societal norms, and inspire empathy and understanding. Through Lee's masterful storytelling and richly drawn characters, readers are confronted with the stark realities of racism and injustice, compelling them to question their own beliefs and biases. The novel serves as a call to action, urging individuals to confront prejudice, seek truth, and strive for a more just and compassionate society. To Kill a Mockingbird remains a literary masterpiece that continues to captivate and educate readers of all generations. Its exploration of timeless themes and its profound messages about the human condition make it an enduring classic, solidifying Harper Lee's place as one of the most influential authors of the 20th century. As we conclude our audiobook summary of To Kill a Mockingbird, we invite you to reflect on the powerful themes and lessons imparted by this remarkable novel. We hope it has sparked introspection, inspired empathy, and encouraged a commitment to justice and equality in the face of adversity. Thank you for joining us on this literary journey, and we look forward to sharing more audiobook summaries with you in the future.